Yo, yo, yo. So I want to show you guys a tour of the inside of the truck. A lot of people want to see what the inside of the truck look like. At least I assume a lot of people do. So I'm going to show y'all, you know, first I'm going to do a little, uh, try to get the full thing, you know, top to bottom. First, I'm going to start on this side. Well, on the front here, you got your curtain to the front of the truck. I'm going to show y'all that in the daytime. But as of right now, you know, top to bottom. So, you got your lights, of course, multifunction. But uh, not all of them do, but you got a little space up here. It's my um, internet, as you can see. We got a terrible connection. Oh, no, we got a decent connection over here. But um, that's my little truck Wi-Fi. I can show y'all or explain that to y'all, but works really well. I recommend it. I'll let y'all know what it is if you're interested. But you got a window right there. Up here, it's my little snack drawer. I need to get some more food, you know. Uh, y'all can see bear, but, you know, I got a PS4. You got your microwave right here. It don't come with it, so you got to buy that. Some companies do, but KLM do not. I have my TV. It does swivel in and out. So if you want to watch some TV while in bed, you can. It's a 32-inch uh, TV. You got a stand on the back. The stand comes um, in the truck. So if you want to buy you a 32-inch TV, I put it like that because the bed lifts up so it doesn't hit it. You got your little desk area right here where I usually keep my laptop. Um... It's actually my logo that I created. I used to do insurance, and I might get back into it later on in life, but as of right now, I'm good. Um, you got a drawer right here, a bunch of little things, phone, uh, extra phone, you know, extra charger, batteries, highlighters, can opener, uh, knife, tablet, all kind of random stuff, HDMI cord. Right here, you got a refrigerator, got a little bit of food, some water. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I need to go grocery shopping. Don't blame me. You know, uh, they got your multifunction um, outlet. They got a home plug that I plug this in. Uh, obviously, got my phone charger plug in for the Wi Fi, uh, laptop charger, your TV, gaming system. They also got a plug back here that you can plug a lot of that stuff into. Okay. This entire mattress lifts up where I keep all my clothes at. Um, so your second phone, you know, laptop, headphones that I use for all my phone calls. You always got to have books on deck, you know, hat. Keep the truck smelling good. Make sure. You know, I like guns, so I go shooting a lot. So I put the posters up there. But what this actually is, this is actually a bed. You actually get two beds inside your truck if you're a KL alum okay but since I do not have a, a team driver that stays up you know more space you got a little fan here for hot days okay you got I guess a little reading light kinda on both sides again that is a window to outside it's dark outside so you can't really see much right now you got a net i'm assuming for luggage and stuff but i don't use it it's just in my way you come over to this side i got my little bag that's where i take you know if i gotta use the bathroom or something i got my um toothbrush in there toothpaste um wipes um floss um q-tips everything like that i do take pictures uh, as a hobby, so I got my camera up there. In here, you got your paper plates, you got your Ziploc bags, your trash bags or grocery bags that you use for trash, napkins. In here, I usually keep some clothes in there, but right now everything's under there. I did get laser eye surgery, so that's what that is, but pretty empty right now, a lot of space. It looks small on camera, but trust me, it is huge inside this truck. You also have a little tray to eat you pull that out when you're ready to eat sit on the bed you know it's just a nice little nice little table so on this side 
you got the drawer. On this side, you got the table. In here, more books, you know. You got to stay reading. Got to keep your brain up, you know. Got to keep your brain healthy. And that's that's pretty much it for the back. Oh, how could I forget? Oh, you got your controls. Let's see if I can shine some light on the subject. Bam. You got your controls here. Um, you got your heater thing right here where if it gets cold in the truck, you can turn that on and it'll pump a lot of heat out. It'll get hot real fast. You got this. Uh, basically, it's for the power in the back of the truck. You know, you got to keep your, um, everything running. Keep that plug that I showed y'all running and whatnot. You got a little alarm clock here that I've never used, so I don't actually know if it works or not. You got another actual reading light. Not that bright and um, gets hot fast. So I wouldn't recommend using it. I just use the light. Okay. But if you got a bunk bed, I mean, if you got a, a roommate or something or a co-driver, you could use that for a little light. But you got that. And you got that at the top as well. So with the bunk down, they don't see that light. Okay. You obviously got your you know hot and cold right there with your fan speed right here is for if they're playing music up front and it's too loud you can click that up and it'll mute it sound system is great in here but it'll mute it turn it off you can hear what they're playing okay you got dome light sleeper dome footwell ambient light dome light it's for the front. So if I turn that on, you won't see it right now. Sleeper berth is the main light in here. Boom. Boom. Footwell light down here. Bam. Bam. Okay. Oops. And then you got your ambient light, which is up front and in the back. Boom. So if you cut them both off, it gets pretty dark. And of course, I got this on, but I just want to show you the footwell one more time. Bam. So it is lit. And up front, they do have a separate one that I will be showing you guys. They do have the vent. Then you also got this small storage space here. You could fit about maybe a phone. And um, as I told y'all, I used to wear, I just got LASIK eye surgery. So I used to, I used to keep my eyeglass case right here and it'll stay there the whole time while my trainer's driving it will stay right there and everything um but i no longer need that and yeah that is the truck if you guys like um like i said i will be showing the front in a second uh in a separate video i'll probably cut it and put them together you may not even see this part that i'm talking in right now but um i'll show you guys the front in the morning where i can show it well clean it up some and uh yeah peace